Hello, my name is Rebecca Metz, the author of The Tech Guide. Today we are going to create a simple financial spreadsheet. Our first step is to open your spreadsheet program. Today we're going to use Microsoft Excel 2010. The first, uh, when you open up your Microsoft Excel spreadsheet or your OpenOffice Calc spreadsheet, you're going to see a number of cells. The cells are these little boxes within the spreadsheet. To the left, you will see the numbers indicating rows. On top, you will see letters indicating columns. Wherever your cursor has, whatever cell your cursor has selected, you will see that cell name in the upper left hand corner. For example, right now we're looking at A1. Right now, C5. Our first step is going to, we're going to take a look and we're going to start our spreadsheet and we're going to start at A1 and we'll enter the first word called item. Next, we'll go over to B2, B1 and enter cost. In A2, we'll enter the word printing. In B2, we're going to put our cost for printing, which is $100. In A3, we'll enter the word postage with the cost of $85. In, B, in A4, we'll enter the word envelopes with the cost of $42. And then in A5, we'll enter total and we'll put in our formula equals sum B2, B4. Equals sum B2, B4. When I click on any other cell within the spreadsheet, you will see that it will automatically calculate the total of B2 through B4, which is 227. Be sure to save your work. Thank you. This is Rebecca Metz, the author of the Tech Guide.